Well, Devon Island is a territory of Canada and said to be the largest uninhabited island in the world, although the enormous presence of NASA may change that statistic. It'll take about four minutes to look at three Devon Island locations labeled by Google Earth as number one, roving the Arctic, number two, Arctic Camp, and number three, Drill Hill. And Drill Hill, with its reddish color, is the location most reminiscent of the Mars landing, although all sites qualify as suitable backdrops for Hollywood Martian movie footage. Other videos posted online show these sites with commentary, but I felt it best to reproduce the experiment by personally visiting these locations on December 20th, 2015. Now, Roving the Arctic is a suitable site to produce a Martian movie scene. Here we see NASA's version of the GoPro by remote control, although this rover is not the Star Wars version and only equipped to make movies of a Martian landscape here on Earth. Now, interestingly, we see what could be NASA scientists at the scene. But notice how each one avoids looking into the camera as if trying to avoid facial recognition software. Ah. Next we land at number two, Arctic Camp, with Quonset huts, tents, semi-permanent housing and storage, and a NASA Humvee, Cam General, and other logo attached. We'll take time to inspect the landscape at this site to remind us how well suited this is for a Martian movie production. Curious deployment of multicolored barrels on site. A tower that looks like it could be a satellite uplink. And this curious flat top rock uh, has what appears to be some man-made glyphs on top of it. And now we descend into number three, Drill Hill, where the landscape is already tinted a bit red. And with NASA's R2-D2 GoPro movie robot standing by for a Hollywood director. Now let's take a minute to look at the terrain features so you can recognize them. When presented to you by the media as 2.5 billion taxpayer dollars worth of Martian footage. And if you have any doubt that NASA would commit massive taxpayer fraud, look into the details of the Apollo mission that never landed a man on the moon.